Number two on Eurovision Week 5. Joe, this is an artist from Israel named Netta. The song is called Toy. Toy. Um, and, the, and the person, uh, Lucky Leo, giving us this list. Lucky Bizarre Leo. masterpiece performances. So. so let's see what else you got for us. Got, to, got us right in the heart with that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 2018 winner. Okay. Spoiler alert. Look at me, I'm a beautiful creature. I don't care about your modern town preachers. Welcome, boys, to my choice. Okay, so it's a bit of, well, I like all the cats, you know. Oh, yeah, what are those, the, the lucky cat? I cats? don't know. They're in, You're like, supposed to, like, put a coin in or something? I don't know. They're in, like, the counter of every Asian restaurant in the U.S. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And they sit there and they <laughs> all day. Just pawing at stuff. Um, I, she's a fantastic performer. All the, like, the vocal stuff is very unique, that. I'm not your. Buck, 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 buck. It's almost like chicken balking. That's what I was thinking. Well, she no, even no, goes like is, this. It is chicken balking because yeah, they're doing the chicken dance. <laughs> um, She's doing the chicken dance. Yeah. <laughs> and the background dancers are crushing it up there on their perch. I know. And now it seems they've joined forces. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very good. They've joined forces. And I like this black, pink, and red. That they've got going on. And here. she's throwing, and it seems that she used to be throwing some shade at some gentlemen. Yeah, so yeah. Sounds. A boy. Who a boy acting who's... like a silly, silly boy. A man who's acting like a boy. Yeah. Oh, no, she calls a stupid boy. I'm not your toy, stupid boy. Stupid boy. Yeah. You silly boy. <laughs> All right, let's see what else she says. Yeah, well, this is about what I'm about to say. I'm about to top down on that top topic, Joe. So, 
topic me. That performance was wonderful. And then once she gives us that, like, what, what do you Freaking even call that? Power growl. Power growl. Yeah, that rock star scream. Then it's just like, oh, yeah, there it is. That's, that's what gets There's you your the win. Top. Yeah. Yeah, that's she, your... Yeah, that one's just... Out of that effing part. And then she gives you it one more time oh. at the end and just ends it so strong. It's like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's that's brilliant. It's good. I, love, I love this guy with a chicken on his head and the chicken in his hand. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hear that growl again. Here, pause it real quick. Yeah, that's pretty sick. I'll um, let you die. It's not, and it's not just like a a one note. It's like this. It like revs up. It revs up oh, like an yeah. Yeah. Dude, let, let's just come on. She revs it up like a freaking yeah. chainsaw. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. Send me all the way to camp. My goodness. Yes. I thought you were going to say Canada. And I was like, How, send me with them. <laughs> send me to Canada with that one. I got to go chop some trees Woo. down. Mike, this looks like a mega church. It does. That's Eurovision's mega church. <laughs> I mean, that's Europe's mega church. It's Euro- Eurovision. Eurovision is Europe's mega church. Um, but yeah, she, <laughs> she just sends it. It's wonderful. Dude, send me. Wow. Send me up to the sky and let me fly, fly with the angels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That song right there. I mean, and that's, that's what gets you a number one spot. Like without that moment, you're looking at a number two, maybe a number three, depending on what you're up against. But as, that moment, it just it just seals the deal for you. As self-proclaimed Eurovision experts. <laughs> now that I know everything about Eurovision. As self-proclaimed superstars of Eurovision analysis, no, I'm going to come out here and say, without that power growl, home runs hit. Yeah, She yeah, yeah. came in and she just <sighs> sent it. See you later. Yeah, now that I've watched four weeks of Eurovision. <laughs> yeah, I really just like 20 videos. Yeah. I know so much. This guy is aware of what it takes to be a winner. And you know what? If you're a Eurovision artist looking for someone to run your campaign and lead you to the top, yeah, you will fail if you hire either of us. I am a Eurovision coach, and I will coach you straight to the top ten, straight At to least. the bottom. <laughs> how many? Straight to missing the competition. <laughs> how many? Does every country s- perform every year? I we got to learn how this. How is there? We are do there brackets. We no. I'm okay. I'm pretty sure that every country performs, um, but there's a whole bunch of you know. There's a lot of. Uh, levels to what the, to the country sends. You got to win your country first, right? It's like the Olympics. Yeah, you got to win your country. The and Olympics then you go perform for your country. It's like the Oli- Olympic song contest. The Olympics of entertainment. Yeah. Well, congrats to Netta. She crushed it. That was fantastic. That was tremendous. What a voice. We got to we got to watch a lot of these music videos, right? Because they all have music videos. So, oh, okay. But I, I think so. I think a lot of them do. Well. Uh, I'd Even say Volare. <laughs> Volare. I think that uh, I'd love to get a Eurovision music video week. Top five music videos of Eurovision. So yeah. send, send the lists in and we'll just start we'll start checking those boxes. That's a really good idea. We've done too. a lot of live performances. We'd love to do a lot of music videos. I think the only music videos we've done if you count the little big one we just did and we did cha cha cha. Right. And that's about it. All right. Well, you heard it here. We got we've got to move on. <laughs> You've heard it here first. Moving on to number 1. Net is a star. See you later. <laughs>